close your eyes and try to stay with your breath. You're going to be here for a long time as you meditate, so learn how to like it. In the canon they give the analogy of an elephant brought in from the forest, and he's tied to a tree. And of course, the elephant is trying to do everything he can to get away from the tree. So they do the things that make it nice for the elephant to be there. They try to sing its songs, they bring it good food, so it forgets all of its concerns about when he'll be back in the forest. And that's the first stage in the meditation, is learning how to be at home here in the breath and not want to go back to your old fantasies and old plans. So making the breath comfortable is one of the ways you do this. You can also think about the dangers of a mind that's not trained, wandering out all over the place. Exposed to the sun, exposed to the rain. Today is not too bad, but a few days ago if you'd, it was not that pleasant to be outside. And it's going to happen again. So you're going to find a shelter for the mind. You can't say, well, today's sunny, so I can just relax and do nothing. You've got to provide shelter for the times when it's not going to be sunny. And so one way or another, you try to get the mind so that it is actually happy to be here, content to be here, because there's work to be done here. For a lot of people, just getting to be in the present moment with a sense of ease is quite an accomplishment, but it goes beyond that. Once you're here, you begin to realize the mind is still capable of creating all kinds of stress and suffering for itself. Then you want to dig down, find out what those potentials are, where they come from. So there's real work to be done here, but it's done right here. So you want to learn how to be content right here. Then, as the Buddha says, when with the arahants, once they've finished their work, they find that they like being right here with the topics of mindfulness, right mindfulness. In other words, the elephant, after it's been trained, after it's taught how to do its tricks, it likes being under the tree, and of its own free will will stay there. So in the beginning, though, you have to make sure that you like being here. So talk to the mind, use the breath, work with the breath so it's comfortable, so that the mind likes being here and has a sense of steadiness and stillness while it's here. In other words, it's not ready to go jumping off all the time. Then when you're here, that's when you can start really doing the work.